Hey everyone, I'm Purge, and in this video I'll show you all of my 99 stat screenshots and I'll tell you how I got them. They'll be shown in the order that I got them in, and let me say that when I get a 99 I care about speed rather than cost, so I always go for the most expensive method to get the 99. So you may not want to do that yourself, but I'll tell you anyway. Also, for the sake of clarification, when I say, oh, I trained it from level 80 or I trained it from level 90, etc., I simply mean that I started training it solidly from that level. Before that, it was little bits of training here, little bits of training there, but when I say from a certain level, I mean I solidly trained it from that level. I did nothing else. So, please enjoy. Okay, here we are at my first ever 99, 99 cooking. Nobody else here when I get it, because back then I didn't really have parties or gatherings for 99s, I just got it. Um, I was prompted to get this 99 uh, with the release of skill capes. Um, I had already gotten, as you can see from the screenshot, I would already gotten the quest cape, but it kind of wasn't the same thing. I wanted to get an actual 99 stat, so yeah, I got cooking. Um, I used lobsters. I started training it actually about at about level 85, and I used lobsters till about 95, and then I moved on to sharks. Um, of course, with cooking gauntlets as well. Uh, cost me about 60 mil from 85, about, and um, I did it in Caterpie, as you can see. So there you go. Moving on. Okay, here's my second 99, 99 fire making, alone again when I get it. Um, what I thought was pretty nice is uh, my cooking cape that I was already wearing. Instantly trimmed when I got 99 fire making. Now I thought we'd have to go back to the master, the cooking master, to get the cooking cape trimmed. But no, instantly trimmed when I got 99 fire making, what I thought was pretty nice. Um, I started training it from about 78 um, and I trained it on U-logs and it cost about 15 mil. Pretty cheap if you ask me for U-logs, but yeah. 15 mil on U-logs from about 78. There you go. Moving on. Okay, here's my third Einstein, Einstein Fletching. <laughs> Alone again when I get it. Um, I trained it from about level 85 and I trained with Yu Longbows, um, making the bow and stringing them. Um, cost me about 40 mil, I think, back then. Yeah, about 40 mil. So, yeah, there we go. From about 85 on Yu Longbows, cutting and stringing, and cost about 40 mil. Moving on. Okay, here's my fourth 99, 99 Magic. I trained it from 84, and because I really hated Elking, I went from 84 to 99 on Camelot Teleports. Yep, Camelot Teleports. Really expensive and no money back, but I really, really didn't like Elking for some reason. So, yeah, cost cost about... 90 mil, yeah, really expensive. If you're going to get 99 magic, <laughs> don't do on cam teleport. Elk, please. It just costs way too much on Camelot teleport, so don't do it. Um, from level 84, on Camelot teleport, cost <laughs> 90 mil. Okay, moving on. Okay, here's my fifth 99, 99 construction, and as you can see, there's people here. I'm having a party for my 99, just like magic. I'm having a party. Um, I got 99 construction from 85, and I did it on mahogany dining tables. Um, not flat packing them. I went into the dining room. Built the table on the hotspot, removed it, built it, removed it, built it, and so on and so forth. Um, cost me 120 mil, and let me just say, 
This was before Steel Creation, and this was before the Butler updates. So yeah, hardcore. Woo! <laughs> Joking. So yeah, from level 85 on mahogany dining tables, 120 mil. Moving on. Okay, here's my sixth 99, 99 Herblore. I trained it to 99 from level 82. I used super defense pots and it cost me 140 mil. Now that was actually quite cheap compared to what it is now because this was before the uh, Herblore update. So before extremes and overloads because after the update came out the price of training Herblore basically doubled so I was actually quite lucky. So yeah, from 82 on super defense pots, 140 mil. Moving on. Okay, this is my seventh 99, 99 crafting. I trained to 99 from level 84 and I did it by making green drag, drag hide bodies. Um, it cost me about 50 mil after reselling the bodies. So yeah, now I was going to have a party, but because I was talking to somebody on PM, I just didn't notice the XP and got it just like that without anybody else there because I was distracted. Um, thanks to the person PMing me. So yeah, no party for this one, which I was quite annoyed about, but can't do anything about it. So there you go. From 84 on green dragon hide bodies, about 50 mil. Okay, moving on. Here's my 8th 99, 99 smithing. I trained this one to 99 from level 88 and I did it on Addy plates. Cost about 70 mil after reselling the plates, but really quite fast XP. Um, so yeah, from level 88, about 70 mil. Moving on. Okay, here's my 9th 99, 99 woodcutting. I trained it to 99 from level 89 and I did it on the ivy on the south wall of Varrock Palace. Um, no money in it, but extremely good XP. So if, you're want to, if you want to train woodcutting and you're not interested in money, do it on the ivy because it's just great XP. So there you go. From level 89 on the vines and cost obviously absolutely nothing. Great stuff. Moving on. Okay, so here's my 10th 99, 99 strength. Now, if you're wondering why nobody's saying anything, as I've got it, um, it's because I took the screenshot about a second before they said, oh, grats and stuff. So I didn't take another one for some reason. But so there you go. They look like they're actually silent. But a second later, they, they did actually say grats and stuff. Anyway, I trained strength to 99 from about level 90 and I did it with Slayer. Now Slayer is quite a slow method of training combat stats but I thought well if I can train Slayer at the same time as training, stre and training strength then why not do it. I actually got a massive chunk of XP from the Nomad's Requiem quest because um, that quest gives 50 zeal points and I put it all on strength so I got about 700k strength XP from that one crest ward and I was training strength anyway so it was perfect so yeah there you go that's all of my 99 so far I hope you enjoyed my little rundown of my 99 stats and how I got them and if you did as always please rate comment and subscribe bye for now